you feeling, dude? You healthy? Yes, sir. I'm ready to go. Man, it's been it's been a while since we got there and played in a, a look, I guess, a team-oriented uh, football game in front of the lights, so I'm super excited. Coach, talk about uh, the camp was a little bit different this year in terms of trying to keep you guys fresh, and it's something you've always done. Um, did you notice a big difference in how they approach it? Yes, sir. Uh, what if that was making sure that we're taking care of our bodies, making sure that we're getting the right amount of sleep, making sure that our nutrition was straight, making sure that everything that we were going through throughout this fall camp wasn't going to make our body tear and fall apart as soon as we got to week eight, week nine, week ten. This was all this is what it was all about. To make sure our bodies were fresh and good to go. But while we're still getting enough work to be able to say we feel good going into this week one. Okay, what's it like playing next day during it's big time. Uh, having a, a, a guy that's dynamic like that next to you is pretty big. Somebody that understands football as well as really anybody on the football field just from the experience and everything that he's seen, man, it's something that whenever you line up next to him, you understand that, hey, this is a guy that's going to get it done with me. How cool has it been for you to play with a now an NFL quarterback and now probably another NFL quarterback? It's big time. Uh, you, you see the, the things that Skylar Thompson is doing right now, and, man, it's uh, inside this building doesn't surprise anyone. Uh, man, he's somebody that has made a big impact on my life uh, as far as a football player and off the field, so I'm excited to see everything he's doing. And now with Adrian coming in, I see some similarities between them and uh, just the people that they are, the players that they are. Man, I'm super excited for this season for Adrian. One of the things we've talked about quite a bit today with other people is kind of the buzz around this team. Have you noticed it? I have. It's really hard to not notice, especially every time you, you open up a social media page, you see something, but something we try to tune out, understanding that you have to go and play this game and that things are going to be said no matter what, uh, but everything that you do every single Saturday is what's going to really determine uh, what happens. People talk about a, a locker room and a culture. Define that for me, how it applies to this program. Yes, sir, man. It's a whole bunch of guys in there that are compassionate, love each other and are going to do anything for this bond, for this brotherhood that we've built here. And uh, this is my third year here at Kansas State, and to see that bond and that brother, that brotherhood build over the years has been super exciting to see. And now, I mean, it's seamless, and uh, it's something that's going to carry us throughout the season. I'm super excited. Is this offense going to be a little more diverse? which means maybe Deuce touches it less since you were the rusher and receiver last year? Uh, we will see. Uh, it's one of the things that, I mean, I talk with Coach Klein every single day about uh, how we can get everybody involved. And that's something that if I have to be a decoy in some place to open up somebody else, I'm the happiest person in the world because we may score a touchdown. Uh, and I'm super excited for Coach Klein. I'm super excited for uh, this offense uh, playing behind him. He's somebody I'm going to play for. I'm playing my heart out for, first and foremost. I feel like every single person on the side of the ball feels like that, too. Didn't you refer to him as Ring of Honor, Coach Klein? Pretty cool, uh, isn't it? Ring of Honor, OC, <laughs> one of the best players to come through Kansas State. Man, he he, he embodies a whole bunch of titles, but there's one thing I want to get up under his belt is a, a Big 12 championship this year, so we're going to go out there and do that. Okay, give me the Deuce Vaughn thoughts on this defense. The them boys, I like I like everything that they've shown me throughout this this fall camp, the summer, uh, the way they communicate, the way they fly around, the way they play together. It's one of the things where I mean, you get the ball and you'd be like, man, I don't know where to go. Uh, everybody's flying around, everybody's playing together uh, from the first level, second level to the third level. Uh, it's one of those things where uh, it's super exciting to see. I can't wait for them to cut it loose this Saturday.